Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. Richard Williams carefully scripted the success stories of his daughters, Venus and Serena, before either one had ever actually hit a tennis ball. Now the Williams family's remarkable rise is coming to the big screen and already generating some Oscar buzz for its star, Will Smith. Starring as Richard Williams in the new biopic, King Richard, the story of how this tennis novice with a shopping cart full of old tennis balls coached Venus and Serena to greatness. The movie details Williams overcoming challenges, controversy, gang bangers, and skeptics branding him straight up crazy and how he overcame his troubled past to take the daughters he called ghetto Cinderella's from the public courts of Compton, California to the top of the world. It is a remarkable rise when you think about it. Richard Williams had never hit a tennis ball himself before he coached his kids. The movie is based in part on his memoir. It includes pivotal points in the lives of the young players like the day they practiced with coach Rick Macy. Macy was so impressed, he told their father that he had the next Michael Jordan on his hands. To which Williams replied, nope, I've got two on my hands. Young actors, Celia Sidney and Demi Singleton star as Venus and Serena, and here's a sneak peek. What's going on? Everybody okay? They got a call, said there was trouble in the house. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, you all need to look around. It's a little wet for practice, don't you think? Don't the girls have schoolwork to do? They do their homework. Tundi's first in her class. Lynn and Isha are too. Now I don't even mind you saying we hard on these kids. You know why? Because we are. That's our job, to keep them off these streets. You want to check on the kids? Let's check on the kids. We got future doctors and lawyers, plus a couple tennis stars in this house. The chances of achieving the kind of success that you're talking about is just very, very unlikely. OK, you making a mistake, but I'm going to let you make it. Watch them hit a few balls. All right. So tell me your names again. I'm Venus. I'm Serena. So what'd you think? I wrote me a 78-page plan for their whole career before they was even born. Yeah, baby, yeah! <laughs> These girls are so great, how come I've never heard of them? They're from Compton. It's OK. They're just not used to seeing good-looking peoples like us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's nervous. Make a step up. Maybe she ought to take a few more steps up. Just get someplace safe. I think you might just have the next Michael Jordan. Oh, no, brother man. I got me the next, too. What's the next step? You got to take. You're not going to just be representing you. You're going to be representing every little black girl on Earth. They're not going to let you doubt. How could you? This world ain't never had no respect for Richard Williams, but they're going to respect y'all. Oh. You walk out there with your head up. You are a champion, and the whole world know it. The most dangerous creature on this whole earth. It's a woman who know how to think. Yes, Daddy. Ain't nothing she can't do. You want to show them how dangerous you are? Venus and Serena gonna shake up this world. Venus Williams, who is your best friend? You, Daddy. Serena Williams, <laughs> who is your best friend? Venus. Then you. That's <laughs> Thank you. After Venus. Breaking racial barriers was a theme of Richard Williams' memoir called Black and White, The Way I See It. The book details his rise as the child of a devoted mom who picked cotton in Shreveport, Louisiana and an absent father that he says only showed up to make babies. Mr. Williams recounts his memories of taking beatings from Klansmen and cops and how the guidance of his mother, who preached against prejudice, saved his life. Richard Williams also talks about training his daughters in a violent neighborhood and how it infused them with desire and discipline to leave the hood for good and to pursue their dreams. King Richard will be in theaters coming up November 19th and on HBO Max for 31 days following its theatrical release, and we can't wait to see it. Add it to the great list of tennis-themed movies and documentaries coming out recently. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.